My name is Lauren Stern. I'm 22. I've lived here since March. What I like most about the Mission Project, um, living on my own, knowing that there are other people here like me that have disabilities. The Mission Project has given us an opportunity to give her a life very similar to what it would be like if she were a 21-year-old without disabilities. This whole thing came from Nebraska Furniture Mart. This came from Nebraska Furniture Mart. That thing came from Nebraska Furniture Mart. We think that the Mission Project is a unique program both in the Kansas City area and in the country. And one of the strengths of the program is that we require the parents to be involved in the, in the program. And one of our most critical goals when we established the program was to provide for our children when we can no longer be there. Since, our, since we had the first participant move in in the summer of 2004, we've accomplished a lot. We now have 11 participants living in Mission. They live in apartments that either they rent individually or with a roommate. All of our participants are employed at various locations throughout um, the county and many of them in the city of Mission. When we were approached as a bank, I knew we would want to. I knew it would be supported by you know, our executive committee and the, all of the staff. Our experience has been a good experience, and like I said, it, I think it's opened some eyes of, uh, of ourselves in what we can do to help other people. We feel good about having been here and having, having him feel productive. You know, he's got his list of things to do, and he's very conscientious of that. Hi. He's got many best friends here. I said it just brings out the good side of most of us to be able to have him here. It just brings smiles out to people. Uh, he contributes here and you know we hope we contribute to his life and his days. I have a job at Blue Valley Library and I'm a, my title is a page. I do many things um, and they give me many projects. And I've been working there for five years. My parents are very proud of me. With the monies that we raised through our fundraising efforts last year, we were able to buy a van and also hire a driver who takes the participants who need transportation to and from their jobs. We also started a 24-hour helpline the participants use to ask questions anytime, day or night, and they ask things like what to do about certain cooking situations, what the weather might be like that day, and certain safety concerns. Through our efforts, we have established with Johnson County Community College a history of offering classes at the, their Mission Extension Center at Missions Mall, um, classes that are appropriate for our population for individuals with developmental disabilities. We partnered with the Sylvester Powell Community Center and now they offer the community at large specialized recreation classes such as um, Start Me Up classes which are a general fitness class. thinking that we were going to be out on our own. We were going to have to find our own solution. And um, this just was, when we heard about this, it was just the best thing. Uh, mainly because uh, all the facilities they had, the local, and for us it was very local, very close to us, so um, it worked out just right. This has been the perfect project for her to go to. She's having more fun because she's now having time to, to go to the community center. She goes out with her friends. She's doing more, uh, so it's it's been a it's been a good experience for her. Her moving out uh, had a really good effect on it on the entire family. Uh, we like seeing her when she comes over, and and she likes going home when she's done. <laughs> it's great. No parents. I have great friends. I kind of fell in love. I'm with someone that I care about very much. We've been 
seen each other mm, lots of times because we've been dating and and he had a surprise for me and it was a big shock to me. He got down one knee and proposed to me as him getting married. Of course, I was happy and I was crying and he was crying at the same time, so I know I'm engaged to be married next year. We feel very strongly that our efforts now will help leave a future for our children. They can look forward to having a secure and caring environment once we're not able to help them anymore. Thank you.